Here we are uh, in the hallways of the Ambienta 2023. I'm standing here with Pascal, yes. cooler man. I'm going to introduce you briefly and then you can sort of say a few words about yourself. But it's quite a buzz here, isn't it? This is like, a, like the morning's beginning, there's a lot of uh, we, people we, moving. We think we are now open 10 minutes and you can see it's very, very busy. So everybody comes here to get the latest information, to see what is happening in the market, in the home and gift industry. Yeah, actually, this is what we are doing. Eh? Well, this, is, this, this is the together. day. This is the, no, yeah, we have five of these days, but this looks already amazing. And I think we can better go to a more quiet place. Well, I think we there. can sort of certainly find quieter places, but there's really, it's, I think it's a rare thing to say there's quiet areas at the Ambienta. Uh, I hope we don't have so much quiet places. <laughs> That's what I meant. But there's, it, it, it really is a quiet buzz. Again, it's been a few years of uh, turmoil, ups and downs, and I think it's really great to see humans and have to see humans interacting. How do you feel about that? No, uh, uh, connecting people is always a basis of, of doing business. Eh? It started 600 years ago here in Frankfurt with the Roman people who bring uh, Bibles, the holy books, and sell it here. And yeah, you bring people together. It's the same as Christmas. You bring people together on the Christmas tree, on the Christmas dinner table. Speak, speaking of Christmas and holiday seasons, I, I believe you've been involved in a few projects that, that uh, we're going to have a look at in a moment. But I think for, before we get into the topics of what we're seeing now, how do you feel about the, where we were a few years ago, where we are today? As in, how, how does the Ambiente feel for you this year? Now, the Ambiente feels very powerful. And then we are talking about 20,000 uh, 23, yeah? mm -hmm. So the last Christmas is already gone. All the time that I need to say last week to people that I'm going to the Christmas world doing the Christmas fair, they all said, Pascal, <laughs> are you not four weeks too late? No, Christmas is actually for retail one of the most important times of the year. Eh? If you talk about food, if you talk about giving people gifts, uh, decorate your house, making something special, do something extra. So and that feeling is, is actually always, always the right ambiente. And, 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 and that feeling... Good pun there. Good, 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 good word drop. Yes, yes. And, 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 and it has also to do something with the grandmother who makes the dinner. It's, it's the homey feeling. Eh? It's, 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 for example, one, nobody has a, a bad feeling with it. Well, I think the, the idea of gifts and, 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 and holiday season, we've actually got a lady over here from May 51, and we were talking previously about her beautiful, unique and life-changing uh, gifts. Obviously, she, she's quite busy right now, where you can grab her out of her, her moment uh, yeah, in time. To be honestly, uh, to be honestly we, we worked in this show, in our show, we with, uh, worked with refugees. Mm -hmm. So we had people from the Ukraine, we had people from, uh, uh, from, from Russia. Mm -hmm. We had four Russian people, three people from the Ukraine and uh, two people from Belarus. And the Russian people were uh, going out of the country, they don't want to fight. And, uh, uh, and uh, the Ukraine people had the same, mm -hmm. <coughs> the ladies. So this is something extra layer. Uh, and this is also something, of course, we are doing it here and of course there is a business model in it but in the end it's a people business and and if i maybe we can grab her for a second and have her maybe say a few things about her products as well can i just interrupt for two seconds hi ben wilson's my name from the ambienta team have you got a few words about what what your products are about and what you're doing here yeah 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 absolutely i love talking about my products <laughs> so these are all products which are made by refugees we work around the world with unhcr and they identify groups of artisans who are working somewhere they'll see people in a camp sitting together working making something and maybe they're selling it to tourists or maybe they're selling it to um, people who come and they sell them and they identify them and they say to our team, May 51, here's a group of people, look what can they make. And we work together to co-produce co and design products. We sell them through enterprises based in the country and we work in like first host countries where refugees first go to when mm. they leave their country. So can I talk to you through some of these pieces? What a brilliant pro a program. We've only got a few okay. minutes, but please do show us one, a couple of them. A really good example. It's for example, this is made by Afghan refugees in um, in India. So very intricate. Yeah, yeah. So we're trying to show the skills of the different people, how they work, and what they do. So it's very important for us that we uh, show the refugees in a positive light, They're trying to change the narrative around refugees, so people appreciate what 
positive contributions they potentially are to us and our environment and our climate. And we also make it as environmentally friendly as possible, wherever awesome. possible. Awesome. Well, all the best for the show. It's the first day of Ambienta, so I hope you see lots of great people Come and back. share. share. I'll, I'll be back. <laughs> Christmas presents. Great. Thank you. So let's continue, Pascal. Sorry, yes. I, I got a bit distracted there, no, but, but, no, but that's what this Ambienta is about. You see no. things, you've got to dive in. You're meeting people. It's, it's on the spot. Everything is happening. So exactly. that's good. Take your thing and, and look. Every, we have all kinds of people. Eh? We have the blockbusters of the industry. We have small peoples. We have startups. It's the right mix. Uh, of, of, of information, bringing people together. and uh, Have you seen any big trends this year where you say, hey, I've noticed something this year which is very different? Nah, I'm, I'm here today, actually. Seven meters ago on that side, I started 28 years ago. 28 years? 28 years ago, I started really in this hall next to his hall six and i started there uh, I, I, I sampled myself for free i started here i came out of the farmer area in holland uh, i was a florist and i was doing my work and i was in marketing and we were always big in supermarkets and then one time there was somebody ill and i came here on the spot it was really 24 hours that they asked me can you come here so spontaneity was an important Very part of that decision like i do my whole life eh? i'm spontaneous and going everywhere in my life this is what i like i just we just do it mm -hmm. eh? that's always the motto and that's the same as what we're doing here and then i came here and i saw this this blockbuster industry, what comes together with, 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 with so many chances and opportunities. And then you see the trends of 28 years ago, you see now back and you mm. see the dried flowers back. You see the scented candles back, but always with an extra topic. Mm -hmm. And I always say Christmas is like cooking. I'm a very bad cook, <laughs> but I know taste, especially in wine, and I know some very good cooks or chefs who can cook. And cooking is like making a schnitzel, and that's the same with the Christmas ball. Yeah, now it starts. I yeah, already see yeah. what that, where, where, where are we going? Now, a schnitzel. If you take the normal schnitzel and I'm you... I'm certainly put, intrigued if I have to interrupt. I'm, yeah, I'm intrigued. Yeah. Schnitzel, Christmas. Yeah, and cooking. That's you need to win. If you put it in the, uh, in the, in the, in the, in the, for example, with cheese and ham, it's a cordon bleu. If you put it in the Wiener Schnitzel, you put it some, it's adding on some things. It's the same with adding on glitter or gold. It's always adding on. It's the same Schnitzel. You only cook it on another way. Mm -hmm. You put an ananas on it, and it's the same with this industry. This guy. This guy is not 28 years old, huh? This guy is already 100 years old, this ball. Yeah. And the best selling is still gold, red, and uh, silver. But sometimes there's a glitter on it, sometimes there are flowers on it, sometimes there are birds on it. It's, this is the schnitzel. And adding on. But adding on means also just put 20,000. And it is special. So have you got any favorites in this in your, in your area? Uh, it's, you're asking now the daddy yeah, of all the things. The deadly quick, but I want to find things you're passionate about. The most, what's, what are you most? Uh, what makes you think? Oh, this is great. This is here. This is great. This is here. Yeah. The big wow. That is uh, quite an impressive. What is that? A tree? That's the tree. It's 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 specially made for this show. 80% of everything you see, the uh, the people who are displaying the products here worked a half year before they get the color mood they get the simple this guy get the opportunity to send something and then he asks how many square meters do i have and i give him the total square meters to hope that you put it here in level that we will end somewhere here and actually we ended now in the complete thing he said then we make a special tree for you and I saw it first, the first drawing, I think, yeah, this looks very blockbustering. Okay, it's certainly blockbustering. <laughs> and then it came, and it is blockbustering. Actually, to be very honest, there are a few things not in it, but it was even too big. But otherwise, but yeah, those things I like. Eh? And to be honest, more theater, more sales. Less theater, less sales. But I think all the with Christmas. So, Künden überraschen. Und Künden verführen, das ist am Deutsch. Yeah. So, you do it, and if you put Christmas minimalistic, they will end minimalistic. Christmas is always 
over the top, more rich, more. But I like the, the contrast in your state. If I look over here, I see this Christmas tree. I mean, uh, our, our, big our, our, our big man, Jonathan Ive, just made a new red nose made of paper. I think this is also, this is like part of those larger trends, which is about with minimal effort, quite a large impact. Uh, this is something which is in complete contrast to that tree. This is actually quite innovative and also quite sustainable, I'd say. That's it. And that's the same with cooking. Eh? The desserts is a totally different taste than the main uh, uh, cordon bleu. Oh, so like that, that. That, that's with this also. This is made handmade in India. We have a few of these. So we, we have this more. big guy. We have the guy here. Different colors, so here various forms. The, the big ones, cones, all from paper. And this is actually also a trend, what you see here. Eh? Really, we call it down to earth, it's back to nature. So you see these eco trends still coming back. It's the same with the pots. Eh? They are from uh, ceramic, handmade ceramics. It's a pure thing, it's a, it's a handmade thing. And that is also down to earth. And actually, after Corona, whole life is down to earth. Eh? We all been like this and we all been locked down for weeks and we cannot go to the stores and especially the last two years with Christmas we could not go to uh, we could not go to uh, uh, to stores and buy and and last Christmas it was normal and then we understand that normal was actually not normal well, you so we all yeah. been down to earth mm. it's the same with the refugees it's the same and to be honestly, this is a pure secret, and please don't send it secret out. Secret time. Secret time. This team, and the team for next year, is always already in our head before we are leaving Christmas World Ambiente. Mm -hmm. So this team is already three years old. The whole concept is already three years old. The only thing what changed is, we are here in a completely brand new hall. So the whole thing was already designed for another place. With everything, eh? with, the, with the signing, actually I've been, uh, uh, privately I was in uh, Petra. Beautiful country. City. City, country. Uh, city. Yeah. And, and the pitches, the pitches are from ourselves, but this is from Petra. Oh, wow. So you walk to Petra and, and, and I think, <laughs> this, this, and nobody has a Christmas feeling with it. <laughs> you must be very stupid or very crazy <laughs> to, to cook and say, okay, we take Petra. And there we make Christmas out. Well, the color tone, the color, you use the word earth quite a lot. The idea of coming down to earth, I think the period of time in the last few years has shown us all what do I want in my environment, what do I not, do not, do I not want. And if I think about these earthy times from Australia, so the idea of Ayers Rock, the outback, the, the, the whole uh, Uluru tones and, and, and sand and earth, it feels quite earthing. And, and yeah, I like that. I like that thought. Yeah, but everybody, if you watch out of the window, you see something down to earth. Huh? Mm. Of course, we, we, we did things. We, we, we built completely castles. We nostalgia. It was like Disney. Mm. But OK, 50 percent of the people doesn't like Chris Disney. But nature, we all living in nature. Mm -hmm. And uh, so nobody can't be against it. So shall I show you a little bit more? We have trees from uh, um, Indonesia. We have a lot of nature plants. Eh? This, 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 this. Real, real plants? Real plants. They are hanging there on the ceilings, here on the ceilings. So this, this gives you the homey urban feeling. Eh? And uh, what is very strange for me, or not strange, that really younger people, they see it as new. And I see it as my old job. Eh? <laughs> It's the same as this guy, what is standing here, this plant, for example. They always call it the old lady plant. And you put it here and everybody says, it's a trend. I said, no, the old guy is just coming back. Huh? It's the same as this old guy. He's a very old guy. He's an old guy. Uh, but also now we have the guy over there. Look what we have here. This is made in Germany. They made it in Germany by hand. And that's a handcrafted, uh, what's this guy called? A uh, uh, um, Christian uh, Woodbush. I, I think it's, uh, it's this, uh, nut cracker. You crack the nut, you put a nut in it, and you open it. It's a nut cracker, made in Germany. Mega hit in America. And they like it that it is made in Europe by hand. Awesome. So that it not comes out of another country, where they also can make nice things by hand. 
but this it touch it feels feels already it's quite it's quite a weighty christian it's a nutcracker yeah. who's named christian i and, like and, it and actually 28 years ago i started with these dolls but then in uh, in red and now we have them in brown and and the, the factory are nearby dresden and they make difference here and also this made in germany there's some new manufacturing pros. I mean, this is obviously water cut or laser cut by the by the look of that. Yeah. It's, it's not your traditional Christmas tree that's just green and, and, and looks like a traditional Christmas tree. It's quite modern. It's modern. It's something else. Actually, it's something what is already for years on the market. But sometimes a papapa is the same as the, 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 the paper stars eh, we have here. They are already also for hundreds of years in the market. And suddenly it pops up. And it pops up actually in a very simple style. Very nice made, but not with, with glitters and blah, blah, blah on top of it. Just pure. Very just minimal. And it actually can be collapsed down, correct? Yeah. Here it comes like this. And Christmas is gone. Yeah. Easy, easy storage. Easy storage and, and directly impact. So, yeah. You see, we have different solutions. Oh, yeah. So actually, I do this together with my partner, Rudy Taimann. I don't know where, where he is. Where is he? Where is he hiding? He's hiding. He is he's scared of the camera? Coffee? I hope so. <laughs> huh? So yeah, a lot of people are asking questions. How do you came on these ideas? How? Oh, there, there he is. There he is. There the partner, is. we found him. The, yeah, yeah. Oh, he's, he's, he's running away. He's literally, yeah, he's literally yeah, 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 yeah. Well, let's go over and grab him and get oh, a few okay. words from him as well. Rudy. Yeah. Rudy. Hello. Hi. Hi. Ben How are you? from Ambienta. Hi. Hi. Nice to meet you. Hello. Good. Well, how's your morning going? Oh, very good. You've got yeah. lots of new brochures. The first of new brochures. Candles are burning. Lights are burning. Uh, flowers are ready. People are ready. So we're all very enthusiastic to start again. You know? Awesome. Yeah. We've seen some of your innovations. I really love the folded paper Christmas trees and mm. some of the sort of more. Let me. I, I love the modern interpretations of traditions, and I think they're really, really impressive. He's a big fan of the Nutcracker. What about you? I'm actually quite a big fan. It's something really traditional, something very German. <laughs> yes. uh, maybe also Austrian or Swiss, I don't know. But it's, it's, uh, it's something funny and they make it in such a beautiful quality. It's really amazing. And they are really, they are all kinds of different figures that you can collect. So they're really nice. And we always really like to, in the show that we are doing, Decoration Unlimited, it's always really nice to mix a lot of things. So we have fresh flowers, Christmas trees, balls, natural items, nutcrackers, and, and you can mix everything as long as long as you stay, girl, stay very close to your team mm -hmm. and, and then everything works. And your team is a, you're a duo from the Netherlands yeah. I've, I've heard yeah, before yeah, yeah. And, and how long have you guys been working together? How many years? Oh hallelujah, I think almost 30 years now. So uh, we have been working on Christmas World for 30 years. Uh, and then we are also 30, 30 years a partnership. Yeah, a partnership as well. In private yeah. and in business. Yeah, and this show we are doing now for the 11th time. Uh, with great success and uh, with big, big, big support of all the exhibitors because everything what we do here is with support of Messe Frankfurt and of the exhibitors. Yeah. And you all do it together and that's, that's really important. So that, That's something what actually is the basis of a fair. Huh? Bringing people together, bringing product groups together. Okay, yeah, we can go to the halls and if you want I will bring you everywhere. And then you see the collection of a, of a company in their own booth. And here we use, again with cooking, we make a cocktail. So we do vodka together with sugar, with lemon, and we make something out of it. And, it's, it's and bringing the right tip to And what's very important, you bring people in it, and we always believe in the model of a trichter. How is it called? Funnel. Yeah, the funnel. Funnel. Yeah. funnel. This, yeah. this I learned, I, read, I, did, I worked for the Disney uh, Academy, and you bring them into the tunnel. Like Disney brings you into the main street. We are doing also here. So it's now beginning of February and you're setting into it's Christmas time. Nice. Eh? Mm -hmm. So they all come here and then they go into the halls and they are Christmas magics. Huh? Well, you've curated an experience. So that I think that's what the ambient is so impressive, especially the area you have. You've taken the bits and pieces that maybe don't, don't go together in the minds of the people who have brought them here, but when they, when they see them all together, it fits and works. That's the right thing. thing, that's the right thing, and you always need to do something special. Why we do see something special? Your camera likes it, 
and your cameraman likes it, well, you have another feeling. Otherwise, we always need to add on something on top. And that's what we call with cooking, you always need to put a higher taste. So a little bit too much spices. Yeah, people then like, it people gives like, more taste. People like to see something new every time. Mm -hmm. You know, you have to keep it exciting, you have to keep it fresh. And in the, in the end, most of the buyers on the fair of course, they buy 80% of the traditional stuff, but in uh, the 20% that's there is also to 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 yeah to really create a mood in the atmosphere. Also for shops and retail, you know, it, you have to make it exciting for the consumer as well, so that they that they are buying in the end all the products that we have. So, and do you know why we are doing this? To be no, honest, please do tell us. <laughs> no, it's very simple. That's a secret rule, but nobody may know. Shh, shh, come in close. Come in close. Maybe come here. My yeah. socks? The socks. I've got boring so, socks. I've got boring socks. Ah, the white one. The cameraman is actually black, I think. Huh? I'm not wearing my happy socks today. I love happy socks. <laughs> now, we are, now we are talking. Yeah, now we're talking. Now we are talking. It's very simple. Huh? If you have a sock store, you need to have red socks and happy socks to sell the black ones. Why? Mm -hmm. Everybody comes into the store to see the happy socks, <laughs> and they only buy one, but they buy 20 black. It's the same with the Christmas world. They all like the colors and they buy red. And that's good, as long as they are coming into it. But you need to show something new. Well, maybe that's what Rudy told, is 5%, it's 10%. But if you don't have something new, what everybody's looking for new, <coughs> and they buy traditional, and that's good. But it's the same with your socks. You like your happy socks. And then you come to me, and then you show me the black ones. <laughs> okay, mental note for tomorrow, happy socks, <laughs> colorful socks tomorrow. I really appreciate your time. Any last words and thoughts? I mean, the, the Ambienta is for some people, you've been here many, many years, 28 years. Any words or thoughts of people who are here for the first time? What, what should they be doing? What should they be looking for? What's the idea for the people who've been here for the first time? For the first time, there's one rule. Put your, not your shoes that I have, put your running shoes on. It's huge, it's big. Don't come for one day, makes no sense come at least two days. First of all, go four or five hours into it and let Ambient and Christmas World come over you and see what is in the market. And then make your own things out of it. <coughs> the what, do you mean by, here, what do you mean by that, make your own things out of it? Like, like the chef is doing it in the kitchen, make your own ingredients, uh -huh. make your own, own menu. Don't copy it. <coughs> so make something special, start cooking, with your leftover projects, what you have from last year, eh? the other, other uh, 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 balls you have, mm -hmm. and add something on it. Make something special. And, and that's the whole thing. With, with we just keep walking, they'll, they'll follow us. Yeah, they've, they've, we've got a bit of Memphis here, we've got some more statues. We also have the nutcrackers, but then uh, in other colors. Eh? So as you can see, and we have the ribbons here. Yeah, the whole world is here. So if you come for the first time, just see what is going on on the market, see what products, and please make your own collection, make your own success. The products are here, we have the good prices here, we have the good suppliers here. Just do pick and choose and, 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 and go for it. I think for me, I'm observing a lot of tradition, a lot of things you might have seen in your grandma's house reinterpreted. The reinterpretation thing is, is a word I think is really good for this year because everyone's been, had so much time to think in their homes the last few years. What do I want in my space? What do I want to get rid of? What reminds me of my childhood? What do I want yeah. my children to remember of this period of time? So again, it's, it's about memories and reflections maybe. Yes, and, and, and also starting to rethink, do we need everything or is something special good enough? So it was, I mean, your, your time's very valuable. Obviously, we've got the, the closing end of our little tour here. What's on the, the cards for the next few hours and days? What, what's, what, what's next for you? What's next? Actually, we do quite a lot of interviews. Uh, we, we have a lot of connections. The thing is, what's very nice about what you are doing, but I'm really a little bit curious what you are doing, when you bring our 70,000 or whatsoever square meters, you bring it to the world and you bring it to the younger people. You are the young entertainment. Eh? This is the new world. So the new world means you have the traditional fairs, what we are doing for 680 years, bring them into the internet. And then we are everywhere in Australia, we are everywhere in America, and all these young people like I said, I came here then 28 years ago. You show now that there is an opportunity, there's another world, and this is actually the most important thing for today and tomorrow. 
that you guys bring in what is happening here. So, and just come here and, and visit us. Otherwise, look through your stories the next few days and you are our ambassador, walking around, seeing what's happening. We'll do our best. Yeah, we don't ask you to do it, just go for it and look what is happening. You are, it's just soccer play, it's happening here. Yep. Great, and I think you just said a word, 680 years, lots of tradition. I think what I'm observing this year, and what's really exciting actually, is the, the contrast of looking back to look forward, and in the periods of time at home, we've spent a lot of time in our homes, the choices we're making to, to, to bring things into our life, and maybe get rid of some of those things. Oh, look at this thing here. It's a very traditional Christmas wreath, but it's actually pure light. That's something which I think, again, plays on a traditional element of something like Christmas, but in a new, modern, and interesting, interesting manner. Uh, it's sort of, uh, that's what the first thing I've seen this morning where I think yeah there's a touch of minimalism here a little bit choices being made about things you want to have in your world and that's your world <laughs> and everybody has an own world in America they have another world uh, we do another Christmas over there in the Middle East they also do now Christmas what was the last 50 years not uh, and they also do Christmas and everybody does it this own way but that's the same as cooking eh? the Chinese are cooking on another way than the Italians and sometimes you like it, and sometimes you don't like it. Or sometimes you only like a pizza. And sometimes you like a bratwurst. <laughs> and this is it. <laughs> on, that, yeah. on that note, on the bratwurst, Prasco, thank you for your time. Good Enjoy the you. rest of the show, and we're going to go and see what else we can discover around here. Make something nice of it, okay. and have a good day. Yeah? You take care, bye thank bye. you. So there we go, we're in Christmas World 23. Uh, come down and check it out. Lots of contrast, lots of new things I haven't seen before. Some old things, some new things, and some new interpretations. So come down and check it out.